everyone, this is Susie Q of Susie Q's Happy Little Haven, and welcome to my nursery room window. Hi everyone, so today I have Finnegan with me, and Finnegan is the Woodland Elf Flynn by Laura Lee Eagles, and he was reborn by Emma Bennett. And today is a really special day for us because we are going to be twinning with Shara, and uh, she's got the same sculpt. Um, she's named him Birdie, and um, her channel name is Reborn Living Dolls. And so we are going to be twinning in an outfit that I sent uh, to Shara for twinning um, a little while back. And so I'm excited to get started uh, to do that. So let's uh, go ahead and move the camera around and put this little guy down so that I can show you the outfit that I'm going to be changing him into. There he is. Scooch the camera down just a little bit more. He's a little guy. He's about, he's about a preemie size, um, in between a preemie and a newborn, I would say. Uh, my Tink Twins, I, I considered uh, totally preemie, and so he's kind of in between that size. Uh, but anyway, this is the outfit um, that I'm going to be changing um, Finnegan into, and uh, Shara's going to be changing her birdie into. And it's a two-piece outfit. Um, it's a little shorts outfit, um, which is just darling. Um, it's got two little uh, buttons in the front down here, and it's got these, um, you know, the um, suspenders, which I'm going to have to adjust with the pin, <laughs> of course. And then, um, oh, and it's like a, what color is it? It's like a tan, like a light brown uh, tan color or a beige, medium beige. And then this is the darling little onesie. Um, that came with it. It's got this little crooked pocket with the matching fabric and button as the um, as the little suspender pants. And uh, yeah, it's a little onesie. So uh, let's go ahead and get started and get this little guy changed into his um, outfit. Uh, there is one more accessory I, I needed to show you. Um, I also sent these shoes, or they're not, they're little slippers, or little booty slippers. Um, uh, I sent these to Shara as well for her, for her booty, uh, booty, <laughs> for her birdie. And, um, I just thought that they would look really cute with the outfit. And I have this sort of cotton stuff inside the toes. Um, they came with that, but, um, what I want to do is leave that in there because these are a little bit bigger than their feet. And so he's going to be wearing a pair of socks, plus have this cottony stuff um, in the in the toe to make them so that they don't fall off. And then the socks that I chose um, are these little these little white socks. And I like these socks because they have sort of a knitted look, um, like around the top there, which I thought would be really nice to go with the booties. So. Uh, so yeah, there's a method. There's always a method to my uh, to my changing madness. But um, anyway, one more thing before we start. Um, this is his little uh, his little teddy bear. And um, uh, when I first got him, uh, actually it was before I got um, little Finnegan. Uh, I looked everywhere to see if I could find um, uh, like a uh, St. Patrick's Day bear because um, I knew that as a little elf, he's a little elf, and I'll show you his elf ears. I knew that he would want to pretend that he's a leprechaun on um, uh, St. Patrick's Day. And so he's been doing that every year, ever since I got him. And so he's got this little bear um, that he carries along with him uh, wherever he goes. So let's go ahead and put the little bear aside. And um, I think I hear my hubby outside the door. Just one moment. Okay, I'm back. And that was actually not my hubby. That was the mailman. And uh, he was putting stuff at my uh, front door. My nursery room is near the front door. And so I can hear things going on um, outside the door. And um, so, yeah, that's what was going on. So, um, but anyway, let's go ahead and get started uh, with this little guy. Um, I'll show you the outfit that he's wearing now. It's really super cute. Um, it's one that is a, um, it's like a Disney Bambi little uh, w woodland outfit um, that I, I thought would go really, really uh, perfectly with him. And um, I'm not the original one that found this outfit. Um, 
I'm not sure if it was if it was Shara that first found it for her Flynn or for her um, her birdie. Um, Shara, you're going to have to let me know. But I'm I'm not the originator of finding this, but I later found it after um, the person that found it um, showed showed it off, and so um, here it is. And you know, another person that I, I think it might have been too is my friend um, Janae of Janae's Joy. Um, she also has um, a Flynn sculpt, and it might have been her. So anyway, between the two of you, I'm sure you'll let me know because my memory is failing re me right now, as always. But it's a, an adorable um, little outfit that is so perfect with these little elf babies. Um, it just really is, and I love it. I love it on him. So, yeah. Um, let's see. I'll show you the bottoms, too. The bottoms also have the, the little uh, woodsy uh, Disney characters. And uh, as you can see, got Bambi and Thumper and the, the little skunk. Yeah. Super, super cute. Super cute outfit. And it's in a... Uh, well, this actually says newborn size. So, yeah, it looks like, like I said, he's in between a newborn and a preemie size. He can kind of wear both depending on the brand, as always. You know how that goes, you guys. Um, so here he is in his little, his little onesie. And uh, let's see, where is his shirt? Where is his onesie? Here it is. I'm going to leave his onesie on. And I'm just going to put um, this cute little uh, onesie on over him. And this is a size 48 in the European sizes. And it looks like it's going to fit him just right. Yes, it is. So I wanted to uh, uh, chat a little bit too. Um, let's see. On um, I've been sort of out and about this week um, a couple of times. Um, I went out to, uh, my hubby and I went uh, grocery shopping on Sunday and um, we know we did our usual, we were picking up our groceries and stuff and at one point in, on our shopping, uh, during our shopping, we, um, we always shop at Walmart and at one point in our shopping, um, he went to go get um, the chicken. We always, we have um, barbecue chicken about every other night during the summer here and so um, we always get our chicken at Walmart because it's um, usually the best price uh, anywhere but um, anyway so he went off to get the chicken and I went off to get the vegetables <laughs> and um, when I came back um, when we met back up he had he had in his uh he, he like turned around and then he he whipped around and he grabbed something and he went back around and he and he had gotten me um, a bouquet of carnations <laughs> just as a surprise I mean I was shocked and he showed them to me and my first react he didn't say anything he just showed them to me and my first reaction was oh my gosh those are gorgeous you know because there was different colors other than what I've seen in a carnation before and um, he said, okay, then I'm getting them. <laughs> um, and he explained to me what he meant by that was the fact that um, he saw them. He knew that I liked carnations, um, but he didn't know if I would like those particular colors or not. And so he was, he said, I, it was going to depend on your reaction um, uh, whether or not I got them for you or not. You know, <laughs> my hubby's different like that. Um, but anyway, I'm going to put a picture in right now of the carnations. Um, I, um, and I'll explain about them in just a minute. So here's the carnations. Okay, there they are in all of their beauty. Um, so the ones that we haven't seen before are those, um, the dark burgundy. And um, usually when he gets me carnations, or it used to be in the olden days, um, you know, when in our marriage, he would get me uh, the blue carnations because I used to really love the blue ones. But um, I got kind of tired of the blue ones. And so, um, so, I mean, I never said I did, but... Uh, he just, you know, he saw those and he, and he thought, you know, we've never seen the, this uh, type of or this color of carnation before. So I thought you, you know, I was wondering if you would like them or not. And I said, my goodness, they're gorgeous. 
Um, but yeah, the burgundy ones are my favorite colored ones. Um, but anyway, what I did was all the, the those other little flowers that you see, the little tiny wildflowers, those are actually off of our property. Um, the carnations didn't come with any greenery. Um, they just came um, just in a little uh, bouquet like that, but nothing else. And so I thought, hmm, you know, I really needed to, to get something else for the bouquet other than just plain carnations that were all kind of sprawled about in the vase. And so um, yesterday when I was walking Jenny, I happened to see we have these wildflowers that are coming up, all kinds of different kinds. And um, these particular wildflowers I thought would look really pretty in with the carnations. And so, um, so yeah, I, I got a bunch of those and, um, and uh, I ended up just kind of, you know, putting them in there with the, uh, the carnations. And I think that they look really, you know, they look really uh, cute like that, real pretty. So yeah, like I said, you guys, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to pin the straps. <laughs> uh, they are a little bit big. They are a little bit big, but maybe this elastic is nice and snug. Maybe I can just leave them kind of snugged into the elastic like that. Yeah, turn your head back around, buddy. Turn your head back around. Yeah, he's such a cutie pie. I really love him in this outfit, Shara. Um, I hope that you like your little birdie and his, and his little outfit. Yes, I do, I do. Um, this little guy's got green eyes and um, he's got um, really nice, um, this is mohair and it's blonde and it's layered and it's kind of wavy. And so I kind of like to keep it like that. But while I'm showing you those details, um, He's also got these little, um, tiny little freckle things on his cheeks. And then these are his ears. These are his little elf ears. And let's see if you can see. They're pointed. Oop, my hand. Now, how are you going to see with my hand in the way, right? There's, let me see if I can show you the other one. Let's see. Let me see. It's kind of hard. This is really hard to show. Can you see? There they are. See the little point right there? Little elf ears. You little elf ears. <laughs> so yeah, he's got gorgeous green eyes and um, elf ears. And um, he's got um, um, uh, rooted eyebrows. Uh, pff, not eyebrows. Eyelashes, um, both on top and bottom. He's just really, really done well. Um, I love this little guy. Okay, so let's get his shoes and socks on, on his little tiny feet, little idle, idle tiny feet. And then I'm gonna push this fluff stuff. This is actually um, the, the fluff that you um, put inside Reborns, you know, to fill them out a little bit. Yep, that's what that is. So I'm not sure now that I'm thinking about it, I'm not sure if they actually came with that or if I if I put that in there just to keep the shape. I'm I'm not sure now. Now that I'm thinking thinking on it. You just never know about me, do you? You just never know. But this trick really works because along with the socks, um it really helps to keep the booties on. You know, they're not going to slip off as easily. So yeah, there he is, and I, I don't really need to, um, well, I can, I can get a comb, I can get a comb. Um, let me try, I'm gonna use this, this pick, because like I said, he's, his hair is beautifully layered, and I don't want it to like stick down, you know, I just want it to have a, like a layered look, yeah. And, uh, and my friend uh, Jean of Jean's Dolls and More, I think that's her channel name, or it could be Jean's Dolls and Hobbies. Um, anyway, at one at one point when she saw um, Finnegan before, she said that elves like to keep their ears covered up. And so, yeah, we're going to go ahead and keep their ears, keep his ears covered up because Jean said so. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, everyone, um, sheesh, this was a quick little video. I bet you're happy about that. Um, he's all dressed up in his, his uh, cute little um, um, beigey brown, light brown outfit. And um, he's going to look really, really cute um, next to his, his brother, 
uh, Bertie. And uh, I'm not sure if we're going to um, exchange pictures today. We, we didn't talk about that. And so if we do, you'll see um, a picture of of Shara's uh, birdie as well, but if we don't, then um, I, I'm also going to put um, Shara's channel name uh, either in the title um, of this video or in the description, and that way you can go over and see um, her birdie. And again, she's uh, reborn living dolls. So um, anyway, everyone, thank you so much for joining me today in Little Finnegan. I hope you enjoyed um, seeing him again, this cute little guy and his little, and his little teddy bear. Um, ha let's see, have a wonderful rest of your week. Thanks so much for visiting. And until we meet again, bye-bye from me and little Finnegan. Bye-bye.